I read in class for Echo, unit number 8, the white villager. There was once a large village that lay near a white river. The land was rich and fertile, and the people who lived there were happy and wealthy. They had no animals and lived, peace, lived peacefully. They troubled no one and no one troubled them. Not very far away from the village, there was a town. One day, the people of the town held a meeting. They gathered in the marketplace to discuss a plan for a new road. The road was going to be built between their town and another one. About, so about 50 kilometers away, a large map of the area was suited, and a road was soon worked out. The people decided how much money they were going to spend on building the road. When the this meeting first began and the news of the road reached the people in the village. Some of the villagers got together and went to some to find some of the road. When they reached the town, they went to the office of the district officer and looked at the map. When they returned home, they called a meeting for the villagers. When one of the men who had seen up at the map said, Friends, today some of us saw the map of the new road. It is going to pass close to our village. It will go through some of our best fields and they will be destroyed. Yes, how can we stop this road? The villagers were very angry. They sat in the meeting for a long time. And at last, they thought of a plan. A week after the meeting, a man from the town came to the village and found a great crowd of people beside the river. The man from the town was curious. He went over to where the people had gathered. He faced to the court and saw an amazing sight. There were seven men standing on one bank of the river and seven men on the other. They were holding a thick rock stretched across the river. In the middle, someone had tied a cup. What are they doing? Asked the townsmen. They were taking water out of the river. It's like a man standing close by. With a cup, asked the townsmen. Oh, yes, it's like the man. But it will take us to get a bucket full, said the townsman. Yes, said the man, it is close. But we always get water out of the river like this. It's slow way, but it always works. The man from the town was very surprised indeed. He scratched his chin and said to himself, These people are our men. Then he got back to the town and told as he said about what he had seen in the village. They laughed and laughed. One or two of the men's friends just could not believe that people could be so stupid. So the next day, two of them stepped home to the village to see the set themselves. When they arrived at the village, they found a half crowd of people standing around a tall tree. The trunk of the tree was nearly two meters wide. Two men were busy working on the trunk. Each had a small pen knife in his hand and was cutting the road. They were working so hard and the feet were falling off their foreheads. What are they doing? asked one of the men from the town. Why? They are cutting trunks down the tree, replied one of the villagers. Can't you be with ten knives? said the townsman. How said a village in a crowd? We are well cut tree down with ten knives. But what it will take a year or two, said the townsman. Yes, replied the village. It, it is slow, but it is a good matter. It always works. The men from the town was quite astonished. They went back to the town. And their own behavior spread like 